Hey, 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 you guys, guess what? It's another one of those magical days. The sun is shining. It's a beautiful day. I am enjoying life because of you. That's right. You guys have made everything magical for us this past weekend. The sale was beautiful. It was over the top. You guys made it happen. And thank you, thank you, thank you. Listen, guys, we're out today. We have a new sale, Citrus Springs. It's going to be, oh my goodness, I've lost my train of thought. I think it's going to be April 21st, 22nd, 23rd, but please check the website, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Um, again, 21st, 22nd, 23rd. If I'm right, if I'm wrong, shoot me, who cares? Anyways, we bring the sales to you. This one is awesome too. You're going to get inside and you're going to go, what's that? Where's that? I haven't seen that forever. Trust me, you will. Let's get inside and take a look. All right, as we come in the front door, <clears throat> we are going to go right around this way. Our first stop will be the restroom where we will see some of those magical nice-to-haves to keep you out of the big box stores. Okay. We will step back out of here. We will head this way to our first bedroom here. We will get some nice linens and towels and... I think there's some drapes right there and a blanket. And then we have a big filing cabinet here. I think over here we have several rugs. One, two, three, four. Let me back up so I can get a good picture of that big one there. All right, but I think there's about mm -hmm. six or seven there. I'm gonna turn around this way, guys. We have a nice little vintage nightstand here. Nice lamp. And there is a matching to that lamp out in the uh, Florida room too. Beautiful bed here. Really, really nice condition. We did not strip it yet because the family is still staying in the home. Okay, we wanted them to be comfortable. Two matching chairs. Recently reupholstered. And by the way, guys, we have an entire roll of this fabric. It's beautiful. Two vintage uh, fold-down coffee tables or end tables. Nice sessions clock there with the key, and it is working. All right, right here, we have a little wicker nightstand. Okay. Back up here again. Show you the picture of that guy who is always magically showing up at all these houses. I don't know. It's like he's a ghost. In here, we're going to take you in here, show you another beautiful, beautiful bed right here. Queen size. Both beds are queen. Little vintage nightstand there. We'll take you over here to this side. There's that roll of uh, fabric that I was telling you about. Okay, I'm going to back around this way. We have two stools, an office chair. And here we have a wicker dresser. Nice mirror to go above it. And of course, a beautiful, beautiful stars and stripes right there. All right, we'll take you over here into the master closet. We have some great men's uh, jackets. I know we're getting a little bit out of season for those, but hey, every now and then we have a little freak day and we need a jacket. So there you go. Some blankets and quilts up there. I think we got a couple more blankets and bedspreads over this side. All right, let's back out this way, guys. Very special treat I want to show you here very soon, but I want to save that for a little bit in a minute. Okay, first here. Take a look at this sectional couch. Beautiful, beautiful corner sectional. It's in fabulous shape. Not very old at all. Okay, now take a look at this. Isn't this awesome? Isn't that beautiful? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. World War I, Liberty, Ship, Hatch, Table. Liberty, Ship, Hatch, Table. Look these guys up online. They go really, really high. We have a nice one here, and we have a nice little side table that matches it. Right here, we have a brand new lift chair, and I mean it is great shape. I don't think it was ever used more than once. Um, it has vibrations. It has rollers. It has has all kinds of the remote control has like 20 things on it. Two little end tables there. How about some seashells? Okay. There. Nice little vintage uh, telephone you'd say. No, Greg, it's a Jim Beam bottle. Dun, dun, dun. All right, we have a nice TV stand here in really great condition with a beautiful Samsung TV on top of it, which I personally know is working because I was here and saw it working. All right, we're going to step out here onto the back porch. We have a perfectly good condition vintage Kirby vacuum cleaner. Some vintage kerosene lamps. How about some wine or uh, whiskey jugs there? Look at those. Those are totally retro. Maybe we can get, uh, who was that guy that used to play that? Ooh, dun, dun, dun. 
Mayberry. Mayberry. He used to play the jug. I can't remember his name. Anybody remember that? Text me. Let me know. We have some vintage cast iron. Pinocchio. Mickey Mouse. Cats. Some really great stuff. Shoe sign kit there. I'm trying to remember. Was that Uncle Jesse when he was on uh, Mayberry? Used to play the jug. I think it was Uncle Jesse. Right there. Look at their beautiful little tree there. Ch -ch -ch. Got some nice books, a couple first aid kits, a nebulizer machine. Ooh, let me show you something scary, guys. Ooh, look at there. Okay, a couple wicker baskets. And what do we always say? Not an estate sale if we don't have Christmas. We have to find Christmas in every house. Check out this retro chandelier. That guy is awesome. more pieces here we've got a few rugs here check out this exercise machine here it is a QB. look that up I was very blown away at how expensive they are all right out here we have another great sofa in really really nice condition um, again I don't know if anybody ever used it a couple beautiful po portraits here pictures then check these out you remember these from the 70s and 80s guys everybody wanted one of those this one uh, I I don't know. It's mint condition. It's like it was just made. We have a great day bed over here with two mattresses. You got some mattress under the bottom, some great big pillows there. Right there is that other hatch table. Isn't that cool? Some lamps there, Tiffany style shades on them. There's that match for the one in the bedroom. Nice little table here with two chairs. And then, of course, we have a nice bookcase. All right, let's get you out this way, guys. We're gonna take you into the living room where I'm gonna be showing you my surprise. How about this? Vintage, retro, totally cool Fiesta wear. Not the new stuff either, guys. This is 30s, 40s, and 50s. This guy was an avid collector. As a matter of fact, his entire family was an avid collection. They all have this. There is a little bit of Pyrex stuck in there, just in case. That's for the Pyrex guy to come jump in and grab some. Okay, look at this. Isn't it beautiful? This is like, again, like I said, guys, I want you to remember when you see the prices on this, this is not the brand new stuff. Okay, this is the, the old original pieces. Okay. Some really, really salt pepper shakers. Spectacular pieces. Okay, we'll give you a backup shot there. Two full tables, guys. All right. Let me turn around this way and show you a beautiful, beautiful football cabinet, trophy case. And then a very, very nice, 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 nice dining room table with a side buffet. Okay. Across the top of the buffet, we have placed several canned goods for you. Okay, turn around this way on the kitchen here. We have a little bit of office supplies there. And then we have some silverware, pots and pans, some colorful plates and dishes. Those are not, are not the same as the others. Okay. A few more foods and canned goods. And then over here, we have a few more foods as well. I'm going to back out now. Oh, did I show you these on the wall? Check out that thermometer. Okay. Over here, we'll show you some cleaning supplies. We know that everybody loves to grab those, again, to stay out of the big box stores. Okay, over here we have some vintage pots and pans, some antique uh, bread loaf pans, some muffin tins. Oriental soupware there. Some normal pots and pans. Not normal, regular. Check out these glasses. They're hand blown by, in Mexico, I think he said. But there's a full set there. Got some small uh, Kerr's uh, canning jars. Over here we have GoDaddy, all the appliances you can need. A couple crock pots, fryers. I think we have a food processor, 
uh, bread maker there. And then if I can back up and get you the full shot of the cabinet, the cabinet is totally awesome and it is for sale as well. All right, guys, let's step out into the garage. First to the left here, we'll show you a little bit of cleaning, brooms and stuff like that. Then I want you to see all these uh, fruit packing boxes. There's uh, some here from the 70s. And then we have some totally cool ones. They're not as old, they're from the 90s, but they're still cool. Really, really awesome to make things with those. A couple of life vests there. And believe it or not, guys, see it behind there? It's pizza warming bags. So when you go get your pizza from the store, you throw your in the bags there and it stays warm all the way till you get home. All right, we're gonna take you over here. We got some chains here on the floor. Gotta come along, a little bit of towing supplies there. How about there? We got some uh, hammers, some mulch. Underneath there, we got a few odds and ends, flower pots, water buckets, things like that. I'll take you across here. You got your normal garage kitchen cleaners. I think there's a couple uh, tie down uh, straps there for uh, tractor trailer, winching them down. And of course, back, ooh, look at those retro cans right there, gas cans. Those are awesome. Electrical supplies here, guys. Canning jars. Post risers for your bed. We did get a bucket full of sockets there. Some handful of tools here. I think we have a little patio table. How about a two-wheel dolly? As we come around the corner here, we got a couple of ladders. We got a, an eight-footer and a five-footer. Couple oars there. If you want to go row in your boat? Row, row, row your boat. All right, let's turn around and show you this beautiful Craftsman toolbox. Almost new. I mean, it's not scratched up. It's not beat up. It's not tore up. Still has the keys. Still has the instruction manuals. Like guys, do you need an instruction manual on how to put your tools in your toolbox? But we have it. All right. We got a hedge trimmer there. We got an electric saw. Okay, let me get you a little close up over here. A few odds and ends, a couple brooms, keep your garage clean. And then I'm gonna take you across the table here. We've got some great hand tools, screwdrivers, wrenches. I think we've got some vice grips, tape measures, padlocks. Okay. All right, I think we've about covered that. I just got a few more pieces to show you out here, guys. We have a wonderful working weed eater and leaf blower there but this is the guy I want to show you this is like brand new Toro electric start lawnmower this guy again is almost brand new it's like $489 at the store guys and you know what it is we're in that season it is time to uh, get ready to mow the grass we're almost there then we have another lawnmower a Kohler working fine just not as new all right, guys, I think we have covered everything. Let me get you turned. Remember, guys, everything we do is all about you. We don't want to ever change that. So we're always going to have a magical, magical party with you every weekend. Water, tea. Uh, no tea this weekend. I'll have tea. You guys have water. Um, not coffee because it's not cold anymore. How about some cookies? Let's bring some cookies to the party. And from that, we'll have a little bit of mu uh, music. And we'll have some dancing. And we'll have a party. Remember, guys, everything we do is because of you, for you, and all about you. Have a great day.